you. Welcome back, everybody. Jeff Frick here with theCUBE. We're at the North American International Auto Show. 10,000 press people here today, taking it all in. A ton of cars, beautiful cars, a lot of alternative types of mobility, and that's really the interesting story here, is that it's not just about cars anymore, it's about mobility, it's about last mile, it's about how do we deal with congested cities. Right in the middle of all this is a familiar company, IBM, so we're really excited to have Sachin Lula on, the global automotive lead, Watson IoT from Autolab. First off, welcome. Thank you, Jeff. Jessica Robinson, she's the director of City Solutions for Ford. Welcome, Jessica. That's right, thank you for having me. It's Daniel Shapiro, he's the senior director of automotive from NVIDIA. Daniel, welcome. Thanks so much, Jeff. So really excited to have Joanna Pena Bickley. She's the chief creative officer for IBM iX. Welcome. Thank you. From the outside looking in, you think autonomous vehicles and a lot of these trends are really a, a giant threat. But in fact, I get the vibe that it's really, it feels like it's been an opportunity to kind of reinvigorate. Yeah, no, I think that's a great point. And again, you hear Mark Fields talk a lot about being beyond auto and including mobility. And you know, we know that that's a huge potential growth area for us at the business level. There's a $5.6 trillion transportation services industry that we barely participate in today. And so when you think about the long-term future of Ford Motor Company more broadly, it's a place we absolutely have to be. Automotive is uh, one of our biggest bets in terms of the industry we're going after. We'll see more change in the next five to 10 years than we've seen in the last 50 to 100 years in automotive. So, uh, you know, feel grateful to be part of the auto industry at this point in time. IBM and General Motors have partnered to put Watson inside of OnStar. The purpose behind the entire partnership is truly to redefine mobility as cognitive mobility. Do so in a way that's actually improving people's lives. We work with over 80 different automakers and tier one suppliers and other startup companies. Everyone is realizing that there's no way you can possibly program or write code for the randomness that happens out on the road. The new Tesla system, now with our processor inside, has 40 times more processing power than they previous had. So we're bringing a supercomputer into the car and then it's gone from one camera to eight cameras. A big difference. We can't see what's going on in a lot of factories. We can't see the IoT that's involved in medical imaging, but we can all see our vehicles. We have passionate relationships with our vehicles. So it's a really pointy end of the spear, if you will, of this whole IoT revolution. She's Jessica, I'm Jeff. You're watching theCUBE. We're at the North American International Auto Show. Thanks for watching.